nangyari doon kay sorry, kay Jamil. I mean, ako honestly, ang hindi ko lang din maintindihan kasi 13 million subscribers. Tapos dinilit yung channel, like Dude. dinilit nila. Dude, nothing, nothing of that makes sense. Diba? I've spoke to a few people about that. Oh. In yeah, none of it makes sense. Diba? Kasi hindi ko, hindi ko maintindi. Probably this is emotionally driven. It. One hundred percent. Dahil lumba sa YouTube, dahil tayo na andito, balaban tayo sa relasyon nand dahil sa YouTube. Agang sa, eto. Wow, na kami ng decision. Hindi sa pagiging chismoso. O oh, sige, nagiging chismoso na tayo. Oh, pero... na. Okay lang, podcast na to. Podcast minsan eh. inspirational, minsan chismis. Hindi, tsaka ano to eh. Content creator sila eh. Kasi gusto Tama. mong, gusto mong pasukin yung isip nila. Exactly. I wanna, yeah. You wanna understand what their perspective is. Why did they decide this is a good idea? Kasi, at the end of the day, this is a business that yeah. they built over these years. Oo. Oh, oh. Diba? Like, Pinaghirapan nila to. Ang tagal nilang binuo yun. Matagal nilang binuo yun. Respect and, and, sa kanila. Yeah. And diba? you can sell, you can delete, you can sell it, or, yeah. or or one of them can buy it. Kasi it's it's very normal for creators to break up. Yeah. Diba? Mm-hmm. So, Pero bakit? I mean, kaya nga sinasabi ko emotional driven to. Kasi hindi siya logical talaga. When, a, when emotions are high, mm-hmm. intelligence is low. Yes. Oo. Hindi ko talaga alam. Hindi ko, at very curious ako sa kung no, ano ba talaga. Ang dali kasing sabihin na nag-away sila tapos nag-delete sila ng channel. Pwede ba nating iwan yun at that? Feeling ko hindi. Matalino tong mga to. Alam nila yun. Matagal na sila sa industriya. Diba? Pero Dude, ano kaya? They're yan? business minded. They're entrepreneurial. Yeah. Diba? I don't think that's it. Again, business to. Hindi naman sabihin ano. Pero saan mapupunta yun? Diba? Kasi, nawala lang eh. Alam mo yun? Like, nawala lang talaga siya eh. Nakakapanghinayang. Yes, oo. Pero naniniwala ako na may logical explanation dyan eh. Right. And yun yung gusto kong malaman. Kasi syempre, we don't know what they're going through. Uh-oh. We don't know what they're thinking. Yeah. And it must have just not, you know, they they can't tell the world why. Yeah. You know? And, and you have to understand okay them. Na. You have to understand them. May mga bagay talagang Nakaka- hindi natin curious malalaman. Lang. Nakakurious lang <laughs> talaga. Because how can you do Because this is our livelihood. Oh, oh. It's like burning down your own house. Baka worse pa. Alam mo yun, di ba? Kaya nga eh. Di ba? Alam mo yun? Like, bilang creators din kasi, like ako, I, I would never do that. Di ba? Siguro, the worst that I can do is just not upload. Alam yeah. mo yun? Yeah. yeah. Let myself fade. Di ba? Parang ganun. Pero just to delete the channel bakit kaya ano ba yun kailangan mo to realize like one of the most problematic things is mixing your relationship with YouTube yeah sabi naman nung YouTube team bakit doon na delete sabi ko wala nagkatampuhan po kami natawanan pa sila still medyo bago yung whole vlogging scene in the Philippines it's only been around for a few years mm. pero sa states it's been Matagal around na. twice as long mm, okay. and all the OG Vloggers, na couples, every single one of them break up. Almost every single one, almost. Okay. okay. And okay. they all have the exact same stories. Cause say when you're living your life behind the camera, and you you start to do things for the camera for the entertainment, you kind of lose the essence of your relationship, yeah. and it just it's mm-hmm. it's really difficult. So, siguro pa din natin sabi na na burnout sila. Ganun na lang ba simple yun? Burnout's a very vague word, but... Yeah. yeah. Well, the yeah. fact na vague siya, covered yun na lahat, siguro masatisfy na lang tayo dun, di ba? Yeah, but, uh, I mean, they lost their passion. passion. They definitely lost their passion. Hindi ko sasabihin na mali yung decision nila. Wala, wala, wala akong karapatan. Wala, wala tayong karapatan. Yeah, Curious exactly. lang ako. Yun lang. Bakit? Kasi again, bilang creators, binuo natin to ng matagal. Pinaghirapan natin to. Buhay tama, natin to. Tama. Ano nangyari? Diba? Yun yung nakakapanghinayang lang. Sa business standpoint lang. Alam mo. Yung pinag-usapan natin kanina mm-hmm. about like you have to evolve and you have to change your content mm-hmm. or else it's gonna get stale and mm-hmm. then mawawala yung passion. Maybe they were doing the same type of content for so long mm-hmm. that they just didn't get any more fulfillment out of it. Ah, M- maybe ma- nabor sila. Uh-huh. Uh, but then again, I, I don't watch their stuff so I don't, I don't know if that's Ako rin, true. Eh. But, sure, eh. but maybe that's it. Well, I mean, it's it's okay because they're. I think it's catered towards a younger girl. Younger, audience. oh, hindi I mean, ako pasok sa market. Tanda nila. tayo, pre. Tanda na tayo, pre. Hindi <laughs> tayo pasok sa. Pero yun la, thinking na 13 million to 14 million subscribers ata sila, I think. Ano mo ba la? It's insane. Ako mo ba pang isang million eh, alam mo yun? Pero it'll come out eventually. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. When, the, when they're ready to talk about siguro, it. Siguro, siguro. You know. Pero yun yeah, nakapanghinayang lang din kasi binuunatin to na hirapan tayo dito sa bagay na to and. Yung effort na yun dapat may kapuntahan eh.
Watch the entire episode for free only on Spotify.